I get to marry you today, and you'll be my wife. Until I get to be the part. one greeted by your perfect smile every day when to I To be get the home. one to make you laugh while we cook okay. brushes your hair off your face and kisses your cheek to every feel single the love radiate out of you as you wrap yourself around me every morning, trying to prevent me from leaving I get bed. to be your rock, your best friend, and your lover. I get to experience the purest love on earth from the most exquisite human being I've ever met. You came into my life at a time when I needed your love and understanding. Today we celebrate the beginning of the rest of our lives together. You are my everything, my better half, and my best friend. I could be anywhere in the world, and as long as I'm with you, I feel like you're the most sensitive and caring person I know. So aware of how you make me feel and always willing to listen. You have stuck with me through my best and my worst. I promise to support you, make you laugh, and to be on your side through everything. So grant, O oh Lord, to these, your chosen adopted son and daughter, Greg and Brooke, now will share and have become one heart and one mind in you. May their home be a place where it is open to children who become members of your heavenly household to live among the saints and the angels. Graciously crown with your blessings your daughter, Brooke, so that being a good wife and mother, she may bring warmth to her home with a pure heart and adorn it with welcoming graciousness that is her gift. Bestow also a heavenly blessing upon Gregory, your servant, that he might be a worthy, good, and faithful husband and a provident father. May their lives remind us who know them of the simplicity of the love and the prayer that Joseph and Mary shared in Nazareth with Jesus. May they approach your table and one day approach the table in heaven by how they've lived out their marriage vows and take part of that great banquet. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. I'm not sure what I did to deserve it, and I'm not sure that I'm worthy. But I promise you this, Brooke, I will never stop trying. I will never tire of treating you just a little bit better, make you smile a little bigger, and make you love even deeper. I love you unconditionally and will be there through the bad and the good. I vow to listen to your crazy rants about everything under the sun. I will forever work towards being a better wife to you than the day before. You deserve the world. I love you so much and I am so lucky to get to spend the rest of my life with you. version of Brooke existed until I met Greg. <laughs> I truly have never seen Brooke happier and it makes me so happy to see my sister with someone who encourages her to work harder and become the best version of herself and vice versa. I'm so excited to see the future of this hardworking couple because I know it will be nothing short of incredible. So, I mean, we're at a wedding in the middle of a global pandemic. Like, let's go. We're having ourselves a night. Nothing is stopping this. And like I said, Brooke, you couldn't have been a better person for my brother to build a life with. I'm so freaking happy for you guys. And we are, we are now all ready to watch you guys build a lifetime of happiness together. So if you could grab your drinks, 
Raise them up to the Hortons. 